guys. Take a good look at this crap because this is going to go. I'm so excited. My brother's building me. We did like a mud room. I'll show you guys when he installs it. Maybe in this vlog, honestly, because it's been a while. Hey, it's been a while. And also I'm on this channel, which is weird, but also not that weird. It's just hard to maintain two channels. Anyway, let's get ourselves put together. Still looking for a chair for a big booty gals. Today, actually in real time, Tabria's stuff is launching and that is why we went to uh, Hawaii. So who went out there? There were a couple of like Easter eggs basically. Me? Don't I look like one? Uh, Frankie and Nzinga was in it as well. And uh, we were just kind of sitting around Tabria. It was really fun. It was really nice, cool, fun thing. Um, just kind of something that the brand wanted to do for us because we're all kind of on the same team. Coffee's on deck. Today we just made a little stove. Jaden was making one. All my like cinnamon cocoa got clogged up on top. Jay was making one and I was like, okay, well now I have to make one. Dang. Influence by my own child. Ta-da! I guess I'm done. I don't know. I use a new foundation. I use one of those ones that like the Makeup Forever one that's like a, it's like a sponge and then you just sponge it on. Oh no! Thanks, darling. Nala makes tiny clay rings. Show them your favorite one real quick. This is Nala's favorite. It's got a tail. It's pink. It's a ring. Oh, and a little pig. And then I made Put it on my finger. Stuff for the cat. And I'm making mom and I, you can't look at the couples. Oh, okay. And a little peggy poo. Ah, well, so cute. This is a fox one I made. Oh, I like that one too. Uh -huh. This looks like a duck. It is a duck. Oh, well then, that makes sense. I'm gonna make an Etsy, Etsy shop and sell some of the stuff, like rings, and I also make these. You wanna sell rings on an Etsy shop? What are they? Uh, it's like a collage of she, she shells. Seashells, cats, cats. They, they feel so, they, they are very textural. Cats, cats. I gotta go I film. sell the paper cloths too. I'm sure everyone wants to buy them. Don't you guys want to buy this little, uh... Oh, and these, the one? these are adorable. I like these. Do you want a frog ring? Yeah. Oh, this Hella is cute. A, this is a, this is, I made a, um, a... How about a fish? I made a best friend set, which, it's supposed to be like Dory and Nemo, because they're friends, so... Oh my goodness. I love it. Alright, I gotta go film, children. Be good, remember? If it's not an emergency and you can figure it out yourself, do that. I made the kids tea and the bag opened up. So this is a disaster that has resulted. Really, really ticked me off. What's up guys? I actually finished filming already. Freaking love doing videos that are not fashion videos. Cause dog, it takes way less time. I'm gonna just import the footage. The footage. Okay, everybody in this neighborhood is making me feel like a dummy because I know damn well, okay, the garbage pickup is supposed to be delayed one day. My brother put his garbage out um, early yesterday and I was like, guys, oh, did I tell you? My brother's my neighbor. Um, he put it out early and I was like, mm -mm, tch, 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 you're early, put it back, right? And uh, I was like, it's, you know, it's a holiday weekend. Like garbage gets pushed out one day. And uh, anyway, and they had put it out early anyway, but now I'm looking outside, midday, not even, it's not even 11 o'clock yet, and everybody's got their garbage cans out, and I'm like, excuse me, no, no, but then like, I don't want to be the dummy whose garbage doesn't get picked up because it's hot outside, and it is rank with the kitty litter and stuff, so now I'm like online, like, I'm like doing my video, and then I'm like, hold on, when is garbage day pick up here, because you guys got me feeling dumb, but I'm pretty sure I'm right, and I'm willing to risk hot, steaming garbage to, uh, you know, prove my point here that I'm right. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna just go with the crowd mentality here. I'm just gonna do what everyone's doing just because they're doing it, right? Uh, I just gotta import this video to make sure the audio is okay because, girl, oh, I can't even do it. Ooh, you know what I wanna do, right? We're gonna import these four. 
Audio is good. We're in focus. Do it, do it with me, girl. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Be gone. Okay. I wanted to show you guys what I've been using on my face. Um, I've been destroying my skin with honestly pure retinol serum. Honestly pure. And you guys are like, moisturize, you big dumbo. And I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry, I totally forgot. So I'm gonna use this Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. I'm gonna take the kids to the pool today though. I decided I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take off my makeup, chill, have some breakfast. Uh, I'm gonna work some more today, but this is my favorite thing to take my makeup off with. Clinique, take the day off, the balm. And the liquid is good too, but the balm? Who told you to put the balm on? I'm taking the balm on. And we're just gonna melt this face right off. I swear makeup is just not my, I just don't like it anymore. I don't like it. All that money, all that time. I was trying to tell my brother, I'm like, this is how they keep women down, okay? They make it like not acceptable for us not to have makeup on it for, you know, uh, not me personally, but like, I was like, how many boardrooms have you walked into with women who didn't have their hair and makeup all done, you know, knowing they spent a freaking hour, hour and a half doing their stuff? And that's just that day. Not to mention the seven hours we spend at a salon just getting it colored or cut and da 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 da. Or the, you know, weekly blowout people are getting. <laughs> I was like, this is how the man keeps us down. <laughs> and then he's got us spending our money on this stuff. And he's like, wow, you feel very passionately. I'm like, I understand why you don't. Because you can go to super cuts, okay? Put on some deodorant and brush your teeth and you're acceptable. <clears throat> no. Like I said, I don't have to do this, but you guys know what I'm saying. You guys understand, right? I was like, let me just give you the, the lady perspective. I work at the bank. We're gonna do a little eye repair serum by V. Don't fight with me. We all know it's called V. Just like me, V. Okay, repair them eyes, thank you very much. I'm not gonna put on retinol because I'm about to go in the sun. Um, and then I am gonna put on my SPF, my spiff, my spiff, if you will. I'm using the Sunday Riley one. I don't recommend it because there's nothing special about it and it was just expensive for no reason at all. Oh, although I do wanna get like a really good sunscreen because when I went to Hawaii, I got burnt to a crisp. I was using the Neutrogena one, but um, I heard, you know, the ingredients of it is what really matters. I need like, I'm the palest person in the world and I can only burn, like I need your perspective, you know what I mean? Or a dermatologist perhaps. But I don't need any little cutie pie honey bunches out there that, that go tanning, right? We, we are not the same, I cannot relate. <laughs> so do I moisturize on top of it? I don't, I feel like I don't know how to do this. Toner, was this supposed to go first? What does it even do? Am I putting on too much? I don't know. I work at the bank. I feel betrayed. My boyfriend took our garbage cans out. Now I look like a dummy. We are at the pool, brought the kids to the pool. My parents are here as well. Nala brought a friend over, pooling it up. I'm not pooling. I've yet to get in the pool, but we both felt the water and it is icy cold. <laughs> I just got done buying some black ruched bottoms, just, just the bottoms. Just the plain ones? Yeah, that'll come up to about here, I guess. If they fit, I gotta try them on. <laughs> that'll ruched in the front, just so that they can basically go with whatever top I can find and hopefully cover you my- You bought black ruched bottoms? I did, why, you got 40 pairs? Yeah, what do you mean? That's a plus size staple bottom. Kids will be out here until they want to pass out or they beg for money to get snack and then my we're off. Why would I oh, and since we're here, the curtain saga. I got curtains, they were too short. I sent them back. I got new curtains. I didn't get enough, so I had to order more. I got more curtains. I got 18 panels of curtains from Target. They were 18 different lengths. Okay, and after being sad about that for a long time, I sent them back. Ta-da! No curtains and no shades because I don't like 
the options. Um, I don't like the options I've been given so far. I also got ketchup all over my shirt. Winning! David, Alexis, time to leave for breakfast. What? What's up? I'm not doing this with you. I'm not doing this with you today. I'm not doing this with you! <laughs> what? Finish. Hey, can you get almond milk and, a, and an unsweet stoke? Are you going to Jewel? Yeah. We're out of unsweet vanilla almond milk and I'm out of stoke. The kids drink it all. Yeah, the green bottle of stoke or the purple unsweet. I mean, get my, my cream or two if you remember, but it's. I'll, I'll do. <sighs> so what was I saying? Yeah, so all the content from Hawaii is being shared now, which is so excited to that. So cute, man. She did her thing. Tabria did her thing. The whole. The whole crew, I mean, everybody involved, the photographer, videographers, hair, makeup, stylists, creatively, they did their thing and I'm so excited because those people get to do their thing for me. Guys, look, I didn't show you this, but earlier, having some pretzels, my mom bought one of these picture frame things that just like, you know, holds a picture frame. So it's not that complicated to hold my mirror because I had it just sitting on the windowsill because I used to be over here and it could lean against the wall. Uh, but then I moved it because I couldn't see myself while I was doing makeup. And this is perfect. It worked perfectly. Now everything's perfect. My life is perfect. Wonderful. Perfection. Everything's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I just did not hair. Sure, Shania. I got a new method. It's great. Of course, now I'm doing her hair. Let me show you over here. 9,000 times a week because now she wants to go swimming all the time. So what can you do? I don't know. What are you supposed to do when you have curly hair and you want to go swimming and you don't want to wash it every freaking day? Tell me in the comments if you have any other things. Another pair of bike shorts, another giant tee. Today was a little rush. The landscaper guys were coming and it was also garbage day. And I was like, Lewis took the garbage cans out again. There was still no cat poop in them. So I was like, ah, I'm running. I was running. You know I wasn't running, girl. Stop it. I had set up a little shipped shopper thing last night um, because uh, I had asked Lewis to get me creamer and stoke because the kids had used it and some almond milk. And then he called and he was like, "They don't have the stoke or the creamer." And that's what—that's all my brain comprehended. Even though four seconds later he called and he's like, "Oh, they do have the stoke," <laughs> and he bought it. <laughs> but my brain didn't remember that, so I bought another one. To get my. Favorite creamer of all time. Got four different kinds of sunscreen. This is the one I've been putting on the kids. But like I said, this was all through a ship shopper and she couldn't exactly find what I had asked for. So to be honest, I don't remember what I asked for. And then I couldn't find my phone and then she was all like, it's okay, I'll use my phone too, girl. Um, so she just picked whatever she wanted and we went with it. Oh, pizza, that's what didn't come. And the chicken, oh, the chicken's in the fridge, never mind. Okay, but I ended up getting two mineral ones because I asked you guys on Instagram, like, what I should be using. You know, because, like, I'm, I'm, like, pale, pale. And I showed you guys the picture, which I'll insert here, of all of us on the beach and me somewhere over here uh, being literally just ghostly pale. I was like Casper on that towel. This burns me. I burn to death. It doesn't do anything. So this is for the kids though, because it does help with the kids and it's easy to put on or whatever. But you fly through this. I've already gone through two bottles in the last week. Um, and then I'm trying to go to like Sam's Club, get myself like a economy pack or something. It has the exact same ingredients as this one. So what the difference is, I do not know to be honest. And I, and I used to do like SPF 100, 110 whatever but to be honest it doesn't make a huge difference between once you get over 30 it's just the difference is like one percent so then i got these two which are a mineral one and a bunch of you were telling me to try this girl i don't know what that says la roche passe <laughs> a lot of people were also telling me like sarah you just have to reapply every two hours and, like i literally reapply every 30 minutes oh you have to use a lotion and i was like oh maybe maybe like, I don't know why the spray wouldn't work. I reapply, like, I'm it, I'm thick with it, right? I'm thick with the spray. Um, but I do normally put a base of the lotion kind on first. Uh, so, I don't, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. Like, I'm just tired of burning, and I want to be able to go outside without coming in and being like, well, I'm going to feel that for the next two weeks. Okay. You see my face, right? Okay. We're going to rub it in. I don't have a mirror, obviously. Money? It smells like money. They put little bits of money in here. 
percent of a million other people touching that dollar. Hey, does anyone know how many people like on average touch like a bill, like a dollar bill? That sounds like some information I should know in case I'm ever on Jeopardy or something. Or more likely cash cab. It's all rubbed on. Oh. Hey, doesn't that, that does feel like it looks a little bit better, right? My pimple coming in strong still, doing its thing. Oh, hold on, I kinda like it. Okay, let's make a coffee. I fully intended on just getting straight to my coffee, but oh, things needed a deep clean. Stoke is so good. Stoke is so good though. Stoke is so good. Check on his, uh, his puzzle game over here. Gang, gang. Puzzle gang. Oh, you can watch Bob's Burger Shop now. All right, guess who totally forgot they were supposed to blow dry their hair today? Me. I washed it, finally. And I should have had it up in a bun while I was cleaning. It really got away from me. I didn't intend on cleaning so much just now, but you know, it's like Pringles, right? Once you pop, you just can't stop. Once I start, I just, I'm like, well, I might as well do this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and then, before I know it, everything is spotless, which I just love, but, so we're gonna wet it a little, oh, we're gonna wet it a little more. What I'm going to use is my Dyson Airwrap. Um, we are gonna go out later today. Some of Lewis's family is in town, so we're just gonna meet him for uh, what, dinner, I think? Dinner, Friday night in the city. Baby, baby, traffic, traffic time. It's traffic, go traffic, traffic. And we don't have enough room in the car to fit like everybody, so the kids were already gonna have a sleepover at my brother's house anyway, so it's not a big deal. But you know, I do like to take them when we go out and do stuff, so uh, it's fine. We're going out of town next week for work, and I'm taking the kids with me. I'll be gone for like freaking week, so I was like, all right. Load it up, family. <laughs> We're all going. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and air wrap. I'll, I'll time that. How about that? Lo que eres mi amor. Me le estrellas en mi cielo. Yeah, estar contigo es lo que quiero. En ti sueño todos los días. Pero en la noche. You know what? I just had an idea. What if I see if I can surprise the kids with a quick trip to the quick trip? It's like 30 minutes away but to the comic book store and see if they have those Fortnite comics because they missed out on a couple. Damn it, they're not open yet. Okay, remind me later. <laughs> okay, also while I'm paused here, I'm gonna look up this restaurant that I really like in the city. It's like a fun time, especially if you're like visiting or something. It's just like the restaurant is a fun time and I'm gonna see if they have any openings for tonight. Boom, and they sure do, table for four tonight. 5.30, is that too early? I feel like that's too early, cause you know it takes freaking forever to get into the city. Damn it, and then the next one is 8.15. I got I call Carnival, if you guys have never been there, it's like a, I think it's Brazilian. Um, yeah, I think it's a Brazil, it's not Brazilian, it's, it is Brazilian, I think it's Brazilian. <laughs> Clearly all I do while blow drying my hair is think about everything that needs to be done, because I keep stopping to make appointments and everything else, so now I gotta make Jay a haircut appointment, because I almost forgot that we're going into town next week. Uh, okay, book, please be available, bro. Okay, it's requested, we'll see if he accepts. Hi. <laughs> Dress. It's like a little see-through, I think. I don't know why I turned. I was trying to show you. But that's okay, because I have like a shaper panty on, so I'm not worried about it. And it's from City Chic from forever ago. I bought it in two colors. Or maybe it's from like Macy's, but City Chic. I think I bought it like for something, but. Anyway, it's a cute little eerie dress, and it's so hot. And these are from Aldo. They have very wet in Hawaii. They don't look great now, but this is the face this is the face she's not my favorite face as of recently it looks totally fine on camera it's just like in person i just feel like 
the colors are really, really, really off. But then I'm like, oh, maybe I'm just not used to it. I don't know. I've been trying different makeup and stuff because uh, anytime I put on sunglasses, all the makeup like just completely melts away from this area. Or when I get hot, it's just gone. Like it never existed. And I have no idea how to fix that. So if you have any ideas, let me hear them. But oh my gosh, it's just gone, gone. And then I can't just like add a little foundation and powder. You're like, that doesn't fix it. I don't know what it is. It's just like, no, this area does not accept makeup today. Sorry. Yeah. We ended up coming to Wild Taco. The strawberry margaritas were like syrup now. But the other ones were good. Pro tip keep makeup wipes in the car. Good morning, friends. Good morning from me and Whitney. Yeah, girl. Uh, uh. I was like, what am I going to wear with these? I was like, duh. Where was she wearing? <laughs> okay, it's not the same, but time to make the bed. <laughs> disregard that area that's where I keep my crap that I gotta film and the reason I even made the bed is because I need it to put some stuff on I bought some Birkenstocks some Birkers some Birktinis we did go to the shoe store yesterday and I saw some in person and I kind of like the rubbery ones better anybody else I don't know uh, I've never had real Birkenstocks I've only had like the Target version and I wore them one summer and I liked them these Girl, I don't know. These feel like torture. They feel like I, my, these feel horrible, horrible on the bed of my feet. Um, so I also bought the soft bed ones, right? Oh, that's these. This is the soft, whatever, footbed. This is the regular. I think the regular feel better than the soft ones. Hold on, let me put them on and let me get a side by side. I really didn't like either of these color combos. They both feel like I'm going to get so many splinters, not splinters. Yeah, I'm going to get mad splinters with these. I'm going to get so many, um, <clears throat> what are they called? Blisters. Okay, so I think, you know, they look how they're supposed to look. My tans are just great. It's just this here to here keeps getting darker. Like at the, at the, oh, and here to here keeps getting darker at the pool. Uh, anyway, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I like either one of them. I really don't think I like either one of them. And since I got them at American Eagle, so I think I, I, I mean, I definitely paid full price. I think I'm standing in like $250 worth of uncomfortable sandals right now. Yeah, let's send them back. Let's send them back. Let's be good people with our funds and finances for once. And let's just send them back. You know what? Maybe I'll ask my mom if she wants one first. She's going to come over. We're going to go to breakfast today. Um, there's a new place in A-Town, Aurora. For those of you that are unfamiliar with my locacion, uh, so the fan band wants to go. The kids had a sleepover at Uncle Jason's house yesterday, which, like I said, is literally across the street. Um, so, so they're supposed to be coming home right now so they can shower. I can get them ready and then, well, they can get themselves ready. And then we're going to go to a new breakfast place, which is so cute. If you guys are in the area, it's just like buttermilk, but better and closer buttermilk is far it's in geneva naperville for us something being in a town dog i'm there plus i love aurora so anytime they have something new i'm gonna support uh yeah that's unfortunate i wanted this to work i did try on the plasticky ones at uh famous footwear and those were okay if we have time today which i don't know why we wouldn't i think i'm gonna run nala over to dsw and then we're gonna go to ulta too okay y'all 
So I just did a quick little face and I've been using that new uh, sunscreen I got. I told you guys about it on IG. Uh, it is a little tinted moisturizer. Damn it, I forgot to shake it again. I always shake it after I put it on already. And I have my little chafing relief gel and since I got some short shorts on today and it is hot, hot, girl, hot. I just have it kind of, I have one like all, literally everywhere. So go ahead and use some lotion. There's nothing special about this lotion. It's just what I have. I'm gonna use a bunch of it though. And then I'm gonna put a bunch of this in it. I let my daughter use it too. She freaking loves it. She's like, I'm so shiny. This is the Fenty Beauty Body Lava. Who needs clothes? Oh, is that the color or? Yeah, I guess I should assume there's probably different shades, huh? I don't know. I use a crap load of it. Like you're gonna get these shiny legs, girl. Then I just mix it up and then we just slather the body. In fact, I really wish my daughter was down here because I would just do hers right now. But you know, I got a lot of surface area. I have a lot of leg, <laughs> okay? This little, little, little leggy poo. I have a lot of leg. I have a lot of thigh. I got a lot of all of that. So I gotta get enough to cover it all. Shimmer her up. Just a fun little thing, you know? She thinks she wants to be grown and like, look at, these, look at this jelly girl. She, she thinks she wants to do what grown folks do and I will not allow it. But this, I can like stand behind it. Jelly, 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 jelly. You know, whatever lighting you're in really uh, will highlight or kind of disguise your cellulite. And so whenever I'm in lighting where you can really see it, like online on Instagram, I make sure to never change it. I never change the lighting. I'm just like, I just want all of us to know, it's okay, girl, you can look like this. You're still gonna live your life. You're still gonna prosper. You're still gonna go get biscuits and gravy with the fam. Never. A genuine cutie. Grandma did it. She did it for all of us. Table for eight, obviously. No. No. <laughs> Be gone. The fit. I miss you. Uh, do you want the one with coconut or without? Take your mask off. With it? <laughs> Your food's huge too. That's a lot of food. Yeah, I'm so hyped up. Those, those I know. Look good. I'm about to move. Look at this. Look at those. I like comic books. You got what you need? I like the game books. Yeah, those are cool. Fix your nose, buddy. Oh, oh the Zelda? Thanks. Yeah. The Zelda? My Hero Academia. Yeah. Oh, uh, pick it up. Yeah, I'm getting. I'm Just getting second. Baby scissors club. Forrest came in heavy with the. I'm getting this baby scissors club one. I really like baby scissors. Oh, do you, have you read the other ones? Yes, I have all the other ones. Oh, you, you guys should just be sharing these. Why everybody? You guys live across the street from each other. I have this one. Yeah, she's got it. Why don't you just borrow Veda's? She got like, yeah, I, I finished that book. So see? Awesome. Let me see what you're getting, Forrest. Can I see? Show me who you got, buddy. Who's this guy? I don't know. Uh, icons? Cyborg. 12 pieces. Pretty cool. I like it. I like it. $45. Oh, my God. Nice. Nice, nice. And then my mom is buying stuff for uh, Solomon. She's forcing my stepdad to start reading comics. My camera. Gwenum. Also, Denim. Also, Venom's mask is. Venom doesn't have a mask. He's, um, like this virus. Oh, gross. I would actually want to save up for this. Like, I would want to get that. Yeah, you should that, save up. Save up, no, I'll go have these with you. Whitney. We're at home goods now. Took all the kids to DSW, and it turns out shopping with eight people not the most fun. So Jason took all five kids home. Just kidding, four kids home. And then me, my mom, and Dee are now hitting all the furniture stores, which is the last thing any of those people wanted to do. The last thing. This is so pretty. <laughs> I wish I needed the, oh, you can't really see up close. 
It's so pretty. Oh, they have a bunch of stuff. I did get a stool and I got a really cool lamp that my mom put up front because it was like poking her in the face. This is so pretty. Shoot, I want it. Should I get it? We're at Crate and Barrel now. Every time I come here, I look at this thing and I think, damn, I want to buy that. But it's $1,700 and the hardware is garbage on it. So do I really? I don't know. I'm also thinking about these with that color uh, material on it. But mm, you know, say, you know, say. I am going to go home and measure out a space for this and see if I like it and if it fits in my house and it looks cool in my house. Like I'm going to tape it out. I'm going to buy that. I'm gonna get a coupon first, then I'm gonna buy that. Oh my God. It's literally like still so bright outside. Like, golden hour? <laughs> golden hour. <laughs> I don't know how people see in golden hour, but uh, it's like 7.30 at night. We're leaving TJ Maxx. Rally, we have rallied today. We have seriously rallied. We have literally been either out eating or shopping since, what time did we leave this morning? Like 9.45? Girl. Get some, get some ladies together. Women do be shopping. Women do be shopping. Why are my eyes so dark? Is my mascara? I don't know. Anyway, disregard my face. Thanks. I appreciate it. Guys, let's do a little inception. So this is me currently editing the vlog that you're watching right now. I filmed it like two weeks ago, right? So I've tried a lot of the stuff that I showed in the video and I have feedback now and let's do a little inception. I'm about to watch this vlog with you girl, let's go. So I'm finally gonna show you what I got today, guys. So um, we went hard, this light, right? Which is like really weird, but it goes with the room. Stool, which I'm so excited about. It's like a big, fat, like cushiony stool. And then I got this, which is gonna come into play later. There's this kind of like marble look upstairs in my bathroom um, on the walls and the counters and everything. And so with this, I'm hoping to be able to put it on the edge of my bathtub. We'll follow up on that in a minute. That one didn't work, but I ended up going back and getting one from Marshalls. I returned that one. Uh, my marble stuff, it, it's not actually marble, but it's like marbled. Um, it's way lighter. So I ended up getting one that matches the hardware in my bathroom. It was bigger. It's mirrored. It's from Marshalls and it was only like $5 more. Works way better though. I have my Dyson air wrap. You know, it comes in like this weird little, it comes in that thing right there. Eh, it's just not for me. I ended up buying this, which is like got all these gold kind of shimmery highlights in it. And it's got like this cool like texture and that actually totally worked out, switching my Dyson out. So I put all of my uh, Dyson attachments and everything in here and they all fit very well. And it definitely looks, better without that uh, case. And I just hide the case behind the mirror. It's from TJ Maxx. I got these from TJ Maxx, which are so freaking cute. These are just like little packing bags. I lose them all the time or whatever. I just, just I don't know, they disappear. These were like 10 or 15 bucks, 10 bucks. Really cute. So I use that like to, you know, help separate the kids stuff because I like coordinate their stuff and then I like wrap outfits and then I keep like their hair stuff separate and their swimsuit stuff separate and like their PJ separate and it just really works for us. If you're curious in how I pack in my cube situation and all that, stay tuned for the next vlog um, because I show you. <laughs> this is the rest of the stuff I got from TJ Maxx though. I'm not a fan of Jordan Skinny Syrups to be honest. You guys ask me all the time if I like Jordan Skinny Syrups for um, my coffee. The answer is no, I do not. However, this is simple syrup, grenadine syrup, um, and these are meant, these are all zero sugar, and these are meant for uh, mixed drinks, right? I ended up buying some Don Julio, and um, my stepdad and my mom came over, and I made them a couple of drinks. I made a mojito, and I made a margarita, and they said the margarita was pretty good, and the mojito was kind of like, eh. So, I mean, I didn't try it, and I'm still like reeling from my last tequila adventure over the weekend, so uh, I'll have to get back to you guys on that. So at TJ Maxx, I picked up this. My sister-in-law has super curly hair, and so does her daughter and her kids, and then obviously Nala has really curly hair. My best friend has really curly hair, and so does her daughter. She has really curly hair. So she had suggested that I start using Pattern a long time ago for Nala, 
Um, I, I, I have super straight, easy to manage. Everything is easy peasy for this head of hair, right? I suggest I start using pattern a while ago, and I did. <laughs> While we were at Ulta, she was like, oh, have you tried pattern, da da da? And I was like, yeah, actually, I really like it. I use it for Nala. It's like my latest thing that I really enjoy using in my daughter. And I use the conditioner and the shampoo, the leave-in, all that. And we saw the uh, jojoba oil, and she'd smelled it. She's like, oh, it smells like lavender. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna give it a shot because Nala has really dry scalp. Like, I know it's just like, the pattern jojoba oil and I could probably like get it somewhere else for cheaper or whatever, like a different brand. Uh, but we both got it, okay, and it was $23. And then we left Ulta and we went to TJ Maxx right after and guess what? The same one was right there for like $10. And then they had the nerve to have this giant ass conditioner there, right? This says compared to 16, but I know I spend like 20 something on this. Um, and it was $12.99. What? And so we're like convincing ourselves, so we're like, that's definitely not the same. It's definitely not the same product. That's gotta be a different product because we just spent all that money, paying full price, convincing ourselves to pay full price for it. And then we go to freaking TJ Maxx and it's right there. Speaking of which, let's get into what I did buy Ulta. And I got a bunch of the pattern stuff. That's actually why I went. And they had this little travel case of pattern stuff. Um, so I got, this one has the heavy conditioner for coilies, which she's not. She does the medium one, which is what I bought the big one of. And then it has leave-in conditioner, which we like, and the hydration shampoo. I went ahead and bought um, the curl gel, and I would just probably put that in there. And then this I wanted to try, so I was like, well, I might as well get the travel version just to try it. And this is the styling cream. These are $9 each. Um, and I think this whole thing was 24, so I saved a few bucks. Then, of course, the jojoba oil. All of these travel size products really did come in handy and even the little carrying case was super helpful because while we were out of town in Mexico, which you'll see us in the next vlog in Mexico, um, they definitely came in handy and I love pattern products in Nala's hair. I mean, maybe one day we'll switch it up again, but so far pattern has been the stuff that I'm actually rebuying for her. And then <laughs> I got these little, is this a single or a double? So I got this little espresso cup, right? Check this out, girl. <laughs> it already gone to crank and barrel. What's the difference? There is none, right? There's literally zero difference. There's literally, there's literally zero difference. Except that this one cost me $7 or $8 each. And this one I got two for $6.99. So, I told Dee, I was like, girl, well, let's take some stuff back that we got screwed on and um, we'll just go to a different location <laughs> so we can see what like the other store has. Uh, to continue with Ulta, I got this because when I went to Hawaii, I hung out with uh, Frankie. We didn't know whether or not we had hair and makeup and so we ended up doing it ourselves and I had not brought a curling iron. She let me borrow her curling iron and she, she has like way shorter hair than I do and her uh, wand is way smaller than the one I normally use. I normally use like one and a half inch wand. And so she had let me borrow hers and it was, I think a three quarter inch. And I was like, wait a second. Like those curls stayed so well, you guys. And I think it was just a matter of it being a tiny wand. So I'm gonna try it out again. So this was like 50 bucks. It was a hot tools one. Oh, I also got the Saint Tropez. Uh, <laughs> I've been quite an adventure with the tanning. This is a gradual tan. So this is the gradual tan watermelon infusion. And we're gonna see how it goes. Do not get me started on that watermelon gradual tanner. Just kidding, get me started. Okay, it's not gradual, okay? It is in your face because I put it on and it actually smells pretty good. It smells like tanner, but it smells like watermelon tanner. Like it's, you know, it's doing what it said it was gonna do. Um, not the gradualness though. So I was orangey. I was orangey. It's not the worst tan I've ever gotten, but it's definitely not the best. Um, I don't hate it. I'll probably finish it, but I'm like flying through it. Like, because I need a lot to cover all of this body. And so I won't buy it again. It wasn't horrible, like I said, but it wasn't exactly gradual. It wasn't like the Jurgens one. Okay, this was like a hella impulse buy. <laughs> it says bye bye bloat on it. Um, all the little vitamins and stuff that are packaged like this, they're like, so, they're so adorable. I'm like halfway through this bottle, maybe more so. I can't say that it's actually helping with any bloating because I was experiencing some serious bloating while I was out of town. Um, just like having different food and different drinks and all that kind of stuff. And it like literally, it was so painful, you guys. And I had these pills with me. 
Um, and I can't say that they helped in any way whatsoever. I got this clean, fresh, healthy look pressed powder by CoverGirl. Uh, I just, I don't have any really good pressed powder and I'm always hoping I'm gonna stumble across something like incredible. I'm living for the pressed powder. I actually love this stuff. It's so great. And now I think I remember where I saw it and it was SML talking about it. So Steph was talking about it and um, that's how it had been like incepted into my mind to even get it. And I really, really like it. Um, it. I feel like it does a great job. Like today I'm just wearing that mineral sunscreen that I had mentioned in this video. And then I have a little bit of concealer on and um, I just take this and just to kind of like calm my concealer down because girl I'll be going crazy and right now I'm using one that's way too light just because I don't want to waste it um it's great it's like such a good powder like I don't know I'm not doing myself justice right now but it's a good powder I'm gonna be buying this again for sure packs of these little <laughs> how freaking cute are these I got two packs of these freaking pimple patches so these pimple patches are actually cool. Um, I used it on one of my like really gruesome pimples that I was having like come in. This is a new pimple from the one in the video. Um, it's just a very common place for me to break out. And my daughter started breaking out and she was just kind of like feeling some kind of way about it. And I was like, oh, I got these little patches if you want. Like see, you know, you can put it on, see how it works. And so she did and she's like super into it. And since they're so cute, you know, she likes putting her little sticker on or whatever. Um, as far as I go, <laughs> I put one on my chin and that like mug brought everything to the surface. It grossed me the hell out. And then, um, it's supposed to take like a couple days. It's supposed to do it for a few days. <laughs> well, it, I didn't make it. Okay. I, I had to get rid of it. <laughs> I had to do what had to be done and I did it, but it worked perfectly on Nala. Nala is my daughter. Me and Dee were both like, uh, we were, we were, we were into it. So we got these, right? I got these two. And they were a little costly, but like, look at what this looks like. It looks like freaking frosting inside of a jar. Like, what the hell is this? It's so weird. And then this one's a serum, right? So this is the Buns of Glory, and it's smoothing butt polish to tight, <laughs> tighten and glow. The thing that got me is that it's watermelon, retinol, wheat protein, apricot, and orange flavor boost, right? I mean, flower boost, flavor boost, flower boost. Vegan, yada, yada, right? It's a polish, so you know you put it on the shower and then you wash it off and then i got this one which is the mary jane cbd glow serum 100 milligrams of cbd vitamin a cannabis sativa and caffeine plus uh, glycolic acid boost this i don't even know what the hell it is to be honest with you i think you put it on after yeah four to five drops to dry face neck and chest before other skincare products after cleansing and toning so i'm gonna start using these i will get back to you because i want to say they were both in the 30 dollar range which is a lot for some dumb brand you don't even need. Uh, yes, okay, so these were not cheap, as I mentioned, and I've been using the Buns of Glory. I'll say I probably only used it like four times and I'm more than halfway through because like, I don't know if you're just supposed to take like a minuscule amount or they just think you have a tiny butt, I don't know. But as far as a butt polish goes, I've tried a couple and I gotta say this one's probably at the bottom of the list. Um, for the price, it's not doing what it said it was gonna do. And, uh, I mean, I don't expect it to actually tighten and, and, and whatever the hell, I don't expect any of that to actually happen, but the experience is not quite as luxurious as I thought it was going to be. So hard pass for me would not recommend. <laughs> and then the Mary Jane, uh, CBD glow serum, I, I have had no negative effects from it, but also I do not notice anything different whatsoever in my skin. Um, the only thing that's been causing a difference in my skin lately, I think is the retinol. And even like, I don't know, I've been using a lot of different stuff and I will say my skin overall does look better, but it started looking better before I started using the glow serum. So neither one would be a repurchase for me, but best believe I will use every friggin' ounce, okay? There's not even that many ounces. I will use every drop. A bar spoon, so I just bought one of these for my iced coffee if I wanna stir it. And then I bought this, which is a pack. I'm sure you can get them cheaper on Amazon or um, my sister-in-law ended up getting hers from, I think TJ Maxx. So it's like a little rubberized, you know, ice cube tray, but you can fill them with cold brew or you can fill them with, um, like if we have, you know, if I have like the girls over or something, I would fill them with like little flowers or um, berries or something like that. Something really pretty. Um, and then just make a couple of like, you know, specialty ice cubes for, for the gals. I've already used these ice cube trays, I don't know how many times to make cold brew coffees. You'll see them in upcoming, uh, upcoming vlogs. Again, don't get them a cream barrel if you don't want to spend $15 on them. Go to TJ Maxx and get the ones that come with lids because 
Oh, those are way better. That's the kind of my uh, sister-in-law got and I'm a low-key jelly. I bought all of these cutest little sandals. My baby finally found a pair of shoes that she liked. They are wrap-up ones, which I didn't love because the whole point was that I needed her to have a shoe that she could just slip on and walk out the door because right now it is like a 20 minute freaking adventure. And then I bought a pair of Crocs, you guys. Looky, look at me. I, had, I just had to get them. Big baby Jay got them. And I was like, well, if Jay's gonna have them. And then Jason got some, my brother. And then he got them for Forrest too, his son. So I was like, okay, well, <laughs> croc. We're crocking now. I'm ordering gibbets tomorrow. It's over. And you already know, my gibbet game is hella strong. Actually, where are my things at? Boom. I ordered all kinds of gibbets already. So get in to it. I also got my whole family that one. You know, everybody's crocked up. But I got Selena, baby. I got Bad Bunny. El Chavo, Chilindrina, we got Tina, Hey Arnold, Boba, we got Pan Dulce over here, Bob, Squirtle, I freaking love Squirtle, Squirtle, more Bobas, we got Gerald, more Bad Bunny, we got uh, a Duncan Loco, I have so many of these, like, it took two weeks for me to accumulate freaking 100 gibbets, and the kids love them too, so, I'm a part of that crop gang, still haven't worn them out of the house, but I'm sure my day's coming. <laughs> Well, that's a lie. I do wear them to the bus stop sometimes. Anyway, now officially, that is all that I have for you guys. So I hope that you have enjoyed this video. It's long as I don't even know what I have. I easily took two hours out of this video, okay? But my next one is going to be us traveling and actually going somewhere and doing something. And I have very exciting stuff to share, which probably by the time you see this, it'll either be posted or not. I got another collection of fashion figure, y'all. That's what it is. That's what we're doing. Part three three and a half, kind of four, but really part three. And I'm excited to share with you guys. Yay.